DIY home fries. So let's do it. Get your potatoes. Make sure you clean them really good. I like to get a brush to really brush off the skin because I will be keeping the skin on. So you make sure you clean it really, really good. How I like to cut mine is cut both ends. Then you can sit your potatoes straight up and you can just slice right on down. Depending on the size you want to have your fries, you can have them thicker. We are doing the Western style fries, which are um, the thicker fries. Troy actually wants, <laughs> next time, he wants me to cut them thinner. But for this time, I made them kind of thick and yeah, you cut and cut your potatoes in threes and fours. Again, whatever size you want. Of course, the thinner you cook them, or the thinner you cut them, excuse me, the faster they'll cook, the thicker. It'll take a little bit more time, but no worries. After you cut them, put them in a bowl. And this part is very important and key if you want crispy fries. You want to put your fries in cold, basically a cold bath and leave them in there for at least 30 minutes, at least. Then once you get to that 30 minute mark, mine was probably like an hour or so because I did some errands. You want to dry them off as good as you can. Again, that's going to help with um, getting the fries to be crispy. So the cold bath is going to pull some of that starch off and then dry them off again. It's going to help them heat up really good, get nice little crispy ends and things. But put your fries in a bowl. Put some olive oil and whatever seasonings you like. I did do a quick flash of my seasonings. It was rosemary, thyme, garlic, sea salt. And I also did some um, fresh cracked black pepper. And lay them out on a parched paper. Um, you want to kind of get one layer, meaning don't stack them too much on top of each other so that they can evenly cook on all sides. And bam, these are fresh out the oven, y'all, with some ketchup talk about yummy honey so we loved it and again they were nice and crispy cooked all the way through put your oven on about 4 15 and leave them in there for about 45 minutes you can turn them if you want but Lamary was tearing them up yum